Welcome back to Very Beautiful. You girls requested a makeup tutorial, so I'm giving you the foundation routine that I've been doing for most of the summer. It's definitely a more dewy, highlighted look, so if you enjoy it, give it a thumbs up, and let me know what you want to see next down in the comments below. I always start off by moisturizing my skin, and I'm using rosehip oil because it doesn't break me out. Most moisturizers, and in coconut oil included, give me really disgusting breakouts, but rosehip oil is really non-comedogenic and doesn't do that. Next I'm using a face primer, and this is basically just to prevent my whole look from melting under the Florida sun, because it's hot outside. Then I'm going to take a face illuminator, and this one is Pink Base by Victoria's Secret. However, it's super old. There's an ours one that's really similar that you can use if you're looking for one. But I'm just going to put this all over my cheeks, on my upper lip, and on the bridge of my nose and forehead just to highlight those areas and keep them looking dewy. The upper lip portion is basically to avoid using concealer because it sometimes looks cakey and my upper lip isn't overly dark where I need it so much anyway. Next, I'm going to be using my Smooth Minerals Powder Foundation from Avon, and I'm just going to buff this in with a huge kabuki brush all over my face. Now, it might look dry at first, but since it is summer, I know that my face is going to get oilier, and this is going to keep it looking dewy and not oily, so that's why I use the powder. Now, even though this is a foundation routine, I don't do this look without using my illuminating blush strips. And um, that's just because I feel like it doesn't look complete without it. So taking the bronze and the blush part, I'm just gonna run those all on my cheekbone and a little bit above my cheek, just to keep it looking fresh and summery, like happy, I guess. I don't know, it makes me happy to do this on my face. And then I'm going to use the white portion and just add back a little bit of sheen that I might have lost with the powder to the bridge of my nose, under my eyebrows, a little part of my forehead, and my cupid's bow because as I said that area looks kind of dark so I want to brighten it up but not use concealer because you know I'm lazy and I'm sure you're lazy too. It's cool, it's summer. We can all be lazy together. And you can add it on your chin too but that's optional. If you have like a different shaped chin, I know like some people don't like it. But this is how it looks when it's done. So I'm just gonna awkwardly sing along to a song you can't hear and say goodbye. Thanks.